All right, welcome back boys. Today we're gonna show you how to find the wires for these aux switches here. You got four when you buy one of these Ford F shit. These, wait, Dude. sorry. Anywho, um, there's four wires down here. You can get to the wires two ways. You can do it from up underneath here or you can take the fuse box out. So we're gonna take the fuse box. What are these, 10 mils, all right? Tens? Yep, these are 10 mils. We're gonna take these out real quick. All right, so we got the fuse box out and these are, you're gonna have four wires up here. You're gonna have a, uh, you'll have orange and light green, which is what we got as high idle hooked up to. And we got it ran down here to a purple with light green, which is the high idle. We can show you that in a second. And that one is a, that's a 30 amp. And then you have a solid orange, which is auxiliary number two. That's another 30 amp. And then you have orange and yellow, which is a 10 amp. That's switch number three. And then you have, what is that? Orange and light blue, which is another 10 amp. That's switch number four. And number four we have, no, yeah, number four is the one that we have ran to high, high idle. You want to show them real quick? Up, All right. Just make sure none of these are uh, touching when you turn the key forward because the switches only have power when the key's forward so it don't drain your battery out. And this, well, before we start, you should probably tell them that so they can hear. You have to have the emergency brake yes. activated basically in order to get the high idle going. Ooh wee. Ooh. Sounds good, boys. Yeah, terrible. All right, so yeah, we have it rain to number four, but like I said, you can turn it on and it won't do anything. This thing's all fucked up. We got to look at this. But right now we have number four on and it doesn't turn on. And you just hit the e-brake. There it goes. Definitely pretty nice for the winter. got a kc stage 2 turbo and dude that thing freaking screams with that high idle on but yeah you just shut her down or hit the brake over here oh right there but anyway that's pretty much how you hook up the high idle and then that's how you're gonna get to all your wires so is that pretty much it yep pretty simple it's a lot easier you can do it from the bottom underneath but it's 10 times easier to take this out so yeah what are we gonna do now are we gonna try and do that blue wire yeah you want to try and do it what does that do uh, you can control your fans manually you turn them on and off so you can let them run for a little bit after the truck shut off yeah or when you're towing if you're gonna hit a hill you just flip, flip them on. on which one are we gonna run that to we'll tell Number them three. We'll, we'll tell them later yeah what's up boys you know the drill.